This short video will show you how to find a journal article from two EBSCO databases. Starting from the library homepage, select the databases link under the search box. Browsing alphabetically, look for E EBSCO. Click on EBSCO databases. You may be prompted to log in. This is where you can choose which ones to select. We are going to choose Sanal Plus with full text and we are also going to choose Medline with full text. Once you've selected those two, press continue. This is the search page within EBSCO. At the top you can see the search boxes where you'll enter your keywords. For this example I'm going to be looking at asthma and the nurse's role in educating patients. Within the first box I'm going to type in asthma. Within the second box I'm going to type in nurse without the E. Instead of the E I'm going to use the asterisk symbol. This is a searching trick called truncation and catches the different endings of the word so you don't have to type out the different variations. So this is going to catch the words nurse, nurses or nursing. In the last box I'm going to put in role or educat, again using the asterisk symbol to catch the different endings of that word, or in double quotation marks, self-manage without the E, and again using the asterisk, or self-care in the double quotation marks again, or behaviour. The double quotation marks are used around phrases to search two or more words in that particular order. If you would like to put in another search box, select the plus sign and I'm going to put in the keyword Australia with the asterisk again to catch Australia, Australian. I'm going to select search. This is our results page. On the left is where we can select our filters that we want to use to filter down our results to make them more relevant. So I'm going to put in a specific date range from 2015, press enter. You can see it's cut the results by about half. I'm also going to select scholarly and peer reviewed. And because I want to look at only journal articles, I'm going to select journal article in publication type. So click on the show more link on the left and that just gives you uh, more filters for you to use. And if you scroll down to publication type, Go down until you find journal articles, select that and then click search. And now that will filter down the results to only journal articles. Now I also would like to filter my results by age. Select age on the left hand side. So I want to select middle aged. So I'm going to select the show more. So I can view more options and you can see the there is the middle aged option. Select that and press update. And that brings it down to nine. So once you have your results and you've put in all your filters, then it's a matter of going through the titles, having a look at the preview which you can do by selecting the magnifying glass on the right 
and then you can read an overview of what that article is about. So you can see some articles have the PDF full text for you to go into and download straight away. Some articles have a find it button and this just means that the full text of this article may not be held in this particular EBSCO database, but if you select that find it button, it will search for the full text in another one of SCU's databases. And so if we have it, it will just open it up in a new window for you.